Okay, so these are my boxes. They come like this. They're actually three by three by one inch. This is my tape I use. I get this from Sticker Mule. I usually just put it in the center. I'm just gonna do one for you guys to show you guys, you know, like how I make this. So this is how I make my little boxes. Inwards, and then I push this side down. I'm just gonna show you guys one. I get this from eBay. Like I said, they're three by three by one inch. This is down. So on this side. I measure this, so this needs to be cut down a bit, so I cut it to the size. Let's see. So that's perfect. So what you do with this is that it comes with a sponge. You just damp it, and that's it. Put it on that. It's too much water. Okay, now I gotta make it dry. Anyways, but that's how it's gonna look. I gotta do, I don't know, I think five, six, I don't remember how much I do. So this is how I do my boxes, very cute, small boxes, right? Okay, so this is my book. This is not dirty, this is that sticker that was on it. This is my book I used to keep all my orders on. Like, I write down my orders. It's on my website as well, but these are like my orders that I write down on here to keep track of how much orders I need to do or I have did already. Like I said, this book is like for all my orders. And next, what I do is I usually just sort out my orders to see which ones I do have. And the ones I do have, I usually just put a little check mark in front of it. I would show you guys it, but I have names written down on every like every certain area so yeah okay so these are the other boxes I also use which is probably a lot easier and simple to use you get these from Walmart or you can order them online and they come with a filler inside of it which is a lot better I think because you don't have to put like anything inside of it so let me show you how I do that one it's the same exact way like I did the other one it's a lot easier when you're not trying to record yourself okay as damp as it was earlier and then I just put it on and there's that one so these ones would probably go with like it doesn't matter I can go with a big earring or a small earring so I just showed you different boxes this is the one I usually get this one from Walmart um and the other boxes like I showed you how to do earlier are these boxes which is all like I don't know, I like these ones better, but these ones are easier, okay? And then this one right here, I tried putting this on, but it's not really sticking because it's plastic. I also use this one. You get them from Walmart. I think it's usually like a, a dollar or something. So these ones are especially for the rings because they have like a little thing behind it. And it's not going to look like that. I'm going to put other stuff inside of it. But, you know, so it can be more secured and more safe. Compared to these ones, I'm pretty sure they can get squished in it. But yeah, Walmart, Walmart, eBay. Okay, so this is where I usually print my shipping labels. And it's from PayPal. And I have my own website. So I printed it on my website. Today, I'm going to be shipping 
four labels because the other ones are to Canada. And what's today's date? Today's the 16th. So on the 18th, which would be on Monday, then I push pay. Hopefully the names don't come out. And then we just wait for the process, and then you push done. And then on this side it says print for shipping labels. Okay, and then then I'm waiting for them to pop out on this side. So there it is, it popped out. I'm going to click on this, which is his print labels for pages. And then I click on that. Waiting for this to pop up. I'm just going to show on this side. Make sure it has my roller printer selected. And then I roll my little desk I have right here. I'm going to wheel it to where it has my roll. This is a very, very good investment. I got it. So this, this right here, I like the labels I just printed out. It's a sticker, so you do just pull it off, and then you stick it on. Let's see, right there. Okay. So what I'm going to be packing is the rings, so let's put it in this little pouch right here, very cute, this is how it looks, okay, and hold on, I need to get a business card. So this is my business card. All right, so let's pack this. Perfectly put these right here. So that's it for this one and the rest will be, I'm going to be doing those separately, but um, envelopes, these envelopes, I usually get them from Walmart. They come in a pack of 25 and I believe it's only like $8. And if you have any more questions about anything else, just comment down below and I will get back to you. Okay. Um, sorry. This video was all over the place.